Each week, we ask you guys to report to us on how you are using AI. And we ask the same four questions. And then at the end of this uh, program, we're going to share with you the progress that you've been making. But I can tell you, it's been really exciting. When we started, a lot of you had never used ChatGPT, had no idea what it was. Uh, now, uh, many of you are using it for business and personal use uh, or both. Uh, and very, very few of you are like, what's AI? What's artificial intelligence? If you are in that 5%, artificial intelligence is simply put computers or robots or algorithms that help you uh, solve certain problems, such as you know identifying tumors in a cancer image, uh, identifying cancer in an in a x-ray image, or uh, facial recognition, or voice activation on your phone, or what we've been really focused on and what's taken the world by storm, what's known as generative AI, or AI uh, in text images and audio video that creates something new out of large language models and data sets that it was trained on. Okay, so that's what AI is. Hopefully that'll be 0% by the end of next week. Um, how many times have you used ChatGPT in the past week? Um, when we saw this first, lots of people were like, what's ChatGPT? Now we see that as many people who, almost as many people who are using it once or twice a week are now using it three to five times a week. And uh, nearly three quarters of you, more than two thirds of you are using it more than three times a week. And a, not a number of you, one in five, 10 plus times. What this means is, is ChatGPT is now in your workflow. The, the most popular tool, more than 80% of you have been using ChatGPT, but what was very exciting is we're starting to see that AI for images, AI for search, AI for video, where these numbers are starting to creep up as well, whereas now about one in five of you have played with AI for images, which, um, as we mentioned a couple sessions ago, uh, are still have a ways to go, but can be very exciting and fun uh, when they do work. And, you know, now built into things like Canva, so that they're more accessible and easier to find. And then probably the number that matters the most to me is how much have you guys saved or made using AI in terms of money? And for the first time, we're seeing a significant percentage of you saying tens of thousands of dollars. Now, I can tell you for a fact that Jeff, Nicole, and I have all saved tens of thousands of dollars through these tools or made tens of thousands of dollars uh, by selling AI powered marketing services. In my case, it was by saving a lot of money on a translation we needed to do of a course that alone saved me more than $20,000. But a lot of you are starting to see those savings and it's adding up and the percentages just keep going up. And to me, when I think about measuring our learning objectives and how do I know that this course is making an impact, it's this slide that really gets me psyched. So uh, thanks to the 50% of you guys who um, have uh, answered the poll, I would encourage you guys to, to, to answer it uh, as soon as you, as, as you can. And then we're gonna be launching uh, the, this week's poll uh, on AI and you so we can see how, how your progression is going.